Hey, what's good? I'm Coach Colin Castella, and today we're going to talk about the two secret keys to Kemba Walker's devastating hesitation move. Kemba doing his thing. He's got Lyles on skates. Gets his hands I think of you. Right, now, Kemba Walker has one of the sickest hesitations in the game today, right? He's so good at selling it that players jump to him on the three-point line, and then he gets all sorts of open looks going to the basket. So today what I wanted to do is break down the two keys that make it so powerful. But you're also going to want to wait till the end of this video because I got something free for you that you're not going to want to miss that's going to help you score more points almost immediately. So the very first key to Kemba Walker's hesitation is his eyes. So a lot of players don't realize that your eyes tell the story, right? If I'm getting ready to shoot, the defender probably first knows because of my eyes. If I'm getting ready to pass, the defender probably first knows because of my eyes. If I'm getting ready to catch the ball, the defender probably knows because of my eyes, right? So we want to use our eyes to tell a pretend story or a fake story. And that's why Kemba Walker's hesitation is so powerful. So let's say he hits like a pullback Hezzy where he's going like this. You'll notice that as he pulls it back, his eyes are going to go up to the rim and he's going to raise his chest up just a little bit. Now the reason why this is so important is when your eyes snap to the rim, if your defender standing in front, what are they going to think you're doing? shooting the basketball, right? And so as soon as your eyes start to snap up to the rim, they're gonna close that space because they don't want you to wax a J right in your face, right? Their coach probably just told them in a huddle, hey, don't let him shoot, he's a shooter, right? Especially if you've been watching our videos. So as soon as you pull some sort of move and what we watch Kemba Walker do, he gets his eyes up on rim and kind of freezes for just a second, allowing that defender to start to close the space because then he's got him. So the earlier you can sell your eyes to the rim, the more powerful your hesitation is going to be. All right, so now that we got our eyes and shoulder drifting up towards the rim, it's time for the second main key, and that's what we call a hand shadow. Meaning, as Kemba Walker does some sort of move and he's going into his hesitation, he takes his off hand and starts to shadow it towards the basketball, right? He doesn't actually touch the basketball. He keeps it about this far away, but he keeps a live dribble by keeping the ball hand either on top or on the back right here, so it's still a live dribble. And then he hangs the ball up and, shat and starts to shadow it with his opposite hand. Now, just like the eyes tell the story, what story does this tell the defenders? If I start to shadow my hand over, that probably tells them I'm picking up the basketball, right? And so, Again, if I go like this and they don't do anything, I can raise up into my shot and I can just go into a hesitation pull-up, right? The great thing is you can read what the defender gives you. So as you're going eyes and chest up, we're gonna go a hand shadow at the same time and then we're reading it from there. What you see Kemba Walker catch guys with a ton of this is they'll go hezzy and then they'll boom, cross over because as soon as they close that space, he's got an open lane to the basket. So again, the two main keys that you really, really gotta try is number one, you gotta get your eyes up to the rim early with a little hesitation. Number two, shadow with the hand and I promise you, players will start biting on it every time. All right, so now that we know the two main keys, it's time to put them into practical applications. So what I'm gonna do now is give you some free drills to help you master this specific move. So the first one we're gonna do is stationary shadow. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get low in athletic stance, and I'm just gonna cross the ball over, I'm gonna keep my hand on top, and I'm gonna pocket it, meaning it's kind of a live dribble, but I'm letting it float, and I'm gonna shadow with my opposite hand up towards the ball, selling my eyes up, so I'm going here. Then I'm just gonna cross over, go here. Same thing, each time I'm working on eyes down, eyes up. Eyes down, eyes up. Each time I'm shadowing with that hand, making it look like I'm gonna pick up and going back and forth. Once you get comfortable, you can push for speed, but really sell the eyes, sell the hand shadow each time. All right, next we got shadow finishing. So we're gonna start with a live dribble from the three-point line. So I'm gonna rip right here. You can work on different angles, different finishing options wherever you want. And I'm gonna go a one, two dribble pullback towards the inside. I'm gonna shadow, hesitate, and then I'm gonna cross over and finish a layup on the same side, right? I'm gonna get my rebound, relocate back out, do the same thing. We wanna make sure we're working on both hands. Again, when I'm yanking this pullback, eyes go up, hand shadows before I push it out and go get my layup. All right, if you like this video and it got your hesitation dialed in, hit that like button and then head to the comment section down below and let me know what you want us to break down next. And if you're new to Shop Mechanics, make sure you hit that subscribe button, ding that bell, because we got a bunch of fire content that you're not going to want to miss because it's going to get your game better. And if you really want to, click the top link in the description down below or the top link in the comments down below and get free access to my power handle workout. This is a quick five minute workout that's going to turbocharge your handles and allow you to handle pressure so you don't get the ball stolen anymore. You can handle traps and pressures and pesky defenders, anything you need, right? It's 100% free, instant access today. All you got to do, link in the top description down below. All right, again, I'm Coach Colin Castello, Shot Mechanics Basketball. Thanks for watching. Until next time, splash on.